An entrepreneur's mission to encourage people of his home country to read more has helped him achieve one of his lifetime ambitions. The young Jordanian who started up a mobile library with a few hundred books in the back of his car has moved on to bigger and better things, as we've been finding out. Parking a vintage car near a place packed with young people, using the vehicle as a shelf to set up a bookstore in the middle of the street. This young Jordanian has been traveling the streets of Amman in his mobile library for the past year and a half. Books on the road is a very simple concept, setting up books on a car like a mosaic so the car stands out. It's also an initiative to spread culture and encourage people to read because here people don't read anymore. The idea of making it easier for the readers to obtain books at a modest price seems to be working well. Because like libraries aren't as common in like public spaces as they are for me in the US, um, I think it's a really great concept to give access to people who might not have books often to like be a traveling seller, not just in a storefront. But Haidt also dreams about having his own bookstore. His hometown of Madaba, 30 kilometers from the capital, has had no bookshop or library until now. Running books on the roads has allowed him to save up enough money to establish the first bookstore in his hometown. I made things easier for people because now they can enjoy having a bookshop in the town of Madaba. Thank God, this has attracted many people, and the bookshop is located near schools, so many students come here to take novels, short stories, or personal development books. While the new enterprise called Universe helps its bookworms expand their minds throughout our cosmos, Peit will continue cruising in his car to more remote places of the country, trying to change communities through reading.